How about now? Oh, there I am. I am soundless. <laughs> uh, let's see here. Quickly adjusting some things so that I can... There we go. All right. Shift that over there so that I can see the chat. Shift that over there so I can keep an eye on stuffs. Important stuffs. Um, all right. So, um, as I believe the only person watching right now is uh, my friend Yvonne. <laughs> the... Uh, I, she may already know. I don't remember if I actually said this or not. But, um, the, uh, <laughs> yes, yes, Yvonne, slow mode sucks. I'm sorry. You can get in the Discord, um, if you wish, but you're probably busy or something. But anyway, um, so, ha, two weeks ago, um, I was having some severe technical difficulties. For for anyone who happens to see this uh, at a later time, I was having some severe technical difficulties, and my computer crashed at least three times. I don't remember for sure, but it was at least three times. And yeah, so I'm going to try that again. <laughs> Yay, I have people in my chat. <laughs> Yes, I know it's not the same because then you're not getting the 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 game. That's the word. The word is game. Uh, anyway, um, but yeah. So a couple weeks ago, I was having technical difficulties. Could not actually uh, go. I don't think I actually made it to the full length of the stream that I was intending to go to due to those technical difficulties. I think um, I may have called it like 45 minutes early. I don't remember. Uh, it was two weeks ago. A lot has happened in a, in those two weeks. Anyway, so long story short, technical difficulties took a week off because of reasons, and then in that week off, I got a new system. So hopefully, I have much much fewer technical difficulties. We shall see. All right. But as such, the point of all of that, the point is, I'm starting the fuck over. <laughs> um, because between lag and computer crashes and stuff, who wants to, it's, it, what, anyway, I'm starting over. I didn't get very far, I'm starting over, so fuck it. All right. Um, so, for those of you who are not, who were not here before, or are just now tuning in, or anything like that, um, the, uh, my intention is to play every, um, my intention is to play every Assassin's Creed, um, from beginning to, uh, end, uh, 100 percenting as much as I'm willing to do, which, given the fact that I'm OCD about video games, is gonna be pretty much everything. Desmond, I need you to try and relax. Let me try and stabilize Desmond, I need you to try and relax. Focus. Listen to the sound of my voice. Recognize that what you're seeing isn't real. Just a picture of the past. It can't hurt you. Damn it. It's not working. Give it a moment, mister. He'll adjust. The first time is never easy. We're losing him. Alright. That's enough, Mr. Man. We need to pull him out. Now. Uh, sure. Do I want an ADT shout-out? Sure, sounds good to me. Sure, I won't turn down a shout-out. You okay? 
okay? <gasps> I told you he'd be fine. Bastards! But now, now, I just saved your life. Saved my life? You kidnapped me. You strapped me into that thing. Animus. It's an animus. I don't even know you people. Why are you doing this to me? You have information we need, Mr. Miles. Information? I'm a bartender, for Christ's sakes. What do you want me to do, teach you how to mix a martini? We know who you are, what you are. I don't know what you're talking about. Don't play coy with me. There isn't time. You're an assassin. And whether you realize it or not, you've got something that my employers want. Locked away in that head. Uh, yours. how's my but I'm not volume assassin. for everything, by the not way? Anymore. Um, yes, Yvonne? Yes, file indicated as much. How's it all sounding? Something about an escape. Most fortunate for us. What do you want from me? For you to do as you're told. The Animus will allow us to locate what we need. Once we have it, you'll be free to go. I am not going back in there. Then we'll induce a coma... Good, 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 good. ...and continue good. our work. When we're done, you'll be left to die. Truth be told, the only reason you're still conscious is because this approach saves us time. You're insane. So what is it, Mr. Miles? Live or die? Live or Lie die? Down. I mean... I mean... A wise God, mistake. that doesn't look comfortable. <laughs> the Animus looks like the least comfortable bed ever. inside the animus which is it's a projector that renders genetic memories in three dimensions genetic memory seems you'll need a bit of a tutorial <sighs> very well we'll start simple what is a memory mr. miles it's the recollection of a past event specific to the individual remembering the event yeah sure what if I told you that the human body not only housed an individual's memory, but the memories of his ancestors as well? Genetic memory, if you will. Migration, hibernation, reproduction. How do animals know when and where to go? What to do? That's just animal instinct. Now you're arguing semantics, Mr. Miles. Whatever you call it. Oh, the fact remains, there is a... These creatures hold there is a blue. ...absent the requisite first-hand experience. A howie. I've spent the past 30 years trying to understand why. I discovered something most fascinating. Our DNA functions as an archive. It contains not only genetic instructions passed down from previous generations, but many... Here we are again. Well. The memory <laughs> of our ancestors. And the Animus lets you decode and read these DNA files. Precisely. Yeah, having a little bit of deja vu right here. This is the specific memory we're trying to access. Unfortunately, yeah, I probably need to fix that. I had to fix my mic, so I had to fix this. I probably have to fix Discord too. Um, That's what happened earlier. You got knocked out of the target me memory and that. pushed back to a more stable state. It's not just a new CPU, I got a whole new system. Um, new CPU, updated RAM. Uh, one of the problems that I realized I had, apparently one of my RAM sticks died, so I was down to 16 gigabytes of RAM. Well, shit. <laughs> yeah, I know! Like, I think it died in the stream, too. I think that's what caused the, cra the initial crash. Ooh. Um, Ooh. yeah. Alright, uh, hey, Yvonne, let me know if uh, Discord audio is coming in now. Hello, hello? Testing, testing. Why? It's your subconscious. It's resisting. We've found similar reactions among patients who undergo hypnosis to relive traumatic events. They can't jump directly into the specific yep. memory. I hear they me. need to be eased in. Yay! Even then, there can be problems. So and how do we yeah, fix the, the lag is significantly We find a lesser. memory you can synchronize with. Yeah, the new CPU, new, new RAM, uh, same GPU, but this my GPU is, is much less get. choked now. So it's where we'll have to start. Um, yeah, sometimes I'm that's not the bottom the tutorial program now. Yeah. I will say, um, I, I understand the need to keep the stream chat as, uh, uh, push Warning. to talk. That is Data smart. stream unstable. Attempting to restore uh, however, synchronization. 
I'm trying to play Graveyard Keeper uh, with Hello, a controller, and my push to talk to you my has been prepared in order to better acclimate you to the Sorry. control system. Sorry. So I may not talk too much. Shortly. Still, I'll pop in. That's fine. The synchronization bar represents how in sync you are with. Good to know that you're there, though. If you ever fall completely out of sync. The animus will restore you to your last slow chat. How? Okay. My you are currently Jamie finds my presence close to desynchronization. I find everybody's presence comforting, honestly. I mean, except for people I don't like. Uh, let's see here. How do I turn off slow chat? The animus utilizes a puppeteering concept to control the actions of your ancestor. I'm loading subroutines to validate. Hey, experienced streamer Yvonne, how do you turn off slow chat on Twitch? By exploring the default actions of each input. <laughs> oh god. Oh, please don't. Uh. While standing okay. still, use the head button to observe your environment. Push the V button. Good. Oh, I know this isn't Assassin's Creed related, but I um I found some very amusing uh continue the synchronization process. What's it called? Uh tavern sounding music for the next time we're in we play D and D. If whenever we're next in a tavern. Tavern sounding music? Yeah, meaning like it's well it's got that aesthetic to it. And I'm I'm quite between two fundamental actions. I have no doubt that either you or Yvonne or both of you will murder me for the music. High profile actions are more action oriented. You'll see high profile button to see how your heads up display changes the context of the puppet. YouTube mostly. That that might not actually come into play for a decent little while. Yeah, I know. It's it's a secret that I will be holding on to for however long. high profile actions. Yeah, we'll all probably forget about it by the time it becomes relevant again. By using the empty hand button in high profile. Good. Then again, if you guys just actually do manage to do the hey, let's go there, see it, and then leave, we're trying to get to, and then leave and go back home to plan. Then maybe yeah, you might get to, but you know that's not going to happen. I know you guys. And tumble to the ground. Yeah, that might not happen. It might. Reach the marker before this man does. Knowing us. Oh, I pushed the wrong button. Rip. I went for shift rather than spacebar because, you know, that's what the sprint button is for later games. Oh. Not fair! You started before I was ready! My hand wasn't even on my mouse, man! Cheater. Uh, I gotta get back to this game. It's actually got that Majora's Mask style time thing. Oh! Good luck, man. Don't let the moon crash into the surface. Well, I actually, the animus will also not provide quite other that important bad, but everything the social is set on a one-week schedule on your a lot mm -hmm. more severely than, uh, the different states will be explained than, say, in context Stardew Valley. soon. But otherwise, okay. it plays very much like Stardew Valley, except you're a Crypt Keeper. Well, okay. This icon appears when a soldier is looking at you. The yellow color means the soldier is either unaware or suspicious of who you are. To illustrate the change in awareness level, you will stealth assassinate this soldier. First, lock onto your target. Now, select your hidden blade. Alright, let's see if I can remember With how to do this. Selected, walk up to the you soldier and assassinate like... him. Almost yeah! <laughs> Two weeks. Yeah, I know. Two weeks. <laughs> Best hug ever. It really is the best hug ever. It's like, um, oh, what's that Doctor Who line? It's like, uh, biting is like kissing, but there's a winner or something like that. The dead body has alerted the soldier to type awareness to informed as represented by the witness indicator. 
aggressive actions, um, or socially unacceptable behavior undertaken uh, at this Dragon time, Z on will likely screen. provoke an armed response. Nice. Because it's provoke something I've never soldier. seen. I don't understand like 80% of the references to it, aside from the fact that there are references to it. And it seems like the kind of thing that should be fine anyways. A lot of people like this. I never saw these Notice guys. how the social status icon has changed and it's really to long, exposed. So Use the yeah, the line um, honestly, I recommend Dragon Ball, uh, Kai a lot more than Z, because, um, because Kai, you get all of the main storyline of Z with better anime, with, uh, up remastered animation and, um, no, uh, none of the annoying slash massive filler like the fights that would go on for like 17 episodes or whatever were cut in half this is pointless i think yvonne's spamming us spamming us a little bit yeah and and yeah i i i've, I've noticed that i started watching kai and then i just walked over to uh the original just to see what the main difference was the fights are shorter. They're everything is much more akin to the to the manga, the original manga. Exit the hiding oh, spot. Yep. Um, it it definitely keeps keeps the the pace on the uh, anonymous will on the active side. Uh, yeah. However, job I also feel like easier. it strips down a lot there to the point where which you we can don't really hide. get However, a feeling for the dynamics the of sort of first, and then use a hide spot to Well. Finish. That's the thing, though. Dragon Ball Z is a sequel series to Dragon Ball. Oh, I'm talking it's... about the character. I'm not talking about like the Z Squad or anything. Right now, I'm on uh, the planet Namek. Uh huh. With Frieza and uh -huh. Vegeta, and I watched the through a portion of this of while I was. Blend can be um, activated with the passive use of your legs. While I was watching Kai, and then and I swapped, swapped over to the original series, suspicion. and I'm noticing now use that there's uh, this... the marker behind the soldiers. At the very least, it seems like it's a little bit better on the uh, making you actually give a shit about certain characters, usually the bad guys. Yeah, I mean but, they did yeah. they did fill in a lot on the bad guys side of things. Um, with the with Z versus Kai, um, and the reason for that was because of the filler. It, from my understanding of it in the manga, they didn't have that much depth to the to the villains. They were just we want to destroy everything. Well, that seems to be the still way it is, but now it's also like, Frieza is now ridiculously campy without feeling rushed. I mean, I mean. Remember, Eagle Vision will And honestly, the better animation doesn't do anything for me because I'm listening to it on my second screen and watching it out of the corner right. of my eye. That's fair. Will assist you with staying in sync. The creed. That, Kai of also, tennis. depending on the version of Z you're watching, Kai also uh, uses the original soundtrack from the Japanese version rather than the Bruce Falconer. Um, Version. Yeah, the the music is for Dragon Ball Z. Life. The music Bruce Walker Connor did this kind of like rocky, rock esque uh, synthetic sound for stuff. And while it was an amazing soundtrack, it was diverged Wait, completely from the this one spirit of the series. <laughs> Um, making it a lot more of a hardcore series than it was intended to be. Um, but also there was a lot of drama involving him and other members of his team. Um, and to the point where, like, he, they got sued to the point where they can't use that soundtrack anymore. Essentially. And from my understanding of the events. Um, basically, he took credit for everything that his people did, and none of them got any credit, and it was just his name everywhere. Only that it's done. But this is not the way of Yeah. My way is better. Oof. Try not to dishonor us further. But yeah, I think. I think what, what it is actually reason? fully comes My brother would say nothing, but I want to watch the Only series that, that America grew up with. 
That's fair. Master believes the yeah, Templars the, the, have found something. The show that got a map. lot of people into it's anime. Right. I, I started I off know. watching Naruto. All that matters is the master right. considers it important. Um, you were you were a second generation it. weeb. Yes. I'll, well, you say that, but I did watch some Speed Racer back in the day. That's true. That's true. Speed Racer was technically the first. Spe Speed Racer, Voltron were technically the first. So I, I guess know, I would maybe, make Naruto's the generation uh, the third yeah. generation, and DBZ the second generation. Don't forget Astro Boy. What? That was part of the generation of um, of Speed Racer, though, wasn't he? Yeah. Yeah. Last I checked, I think it was like. I think uh, uh, Astro Boy might have been the actual first to get that, to America. That must be. Yeah. The possibly. Ark of the Covenant. Don't be silly. The Ark There's of the no Covenant. Thing. It's just a story. Then what is it? Couple hundred years I too early for Indiana Jones done. to find it. I want us to this gate before sunrise. Uh, pardon me while I go and uh, hand out flyers for a witch burning. <laughs> Robert de Saab, his life and is provide mine. the archbishop with the fire. No, loop. we would ask to retrieve the treasure <laughs> and deal with Robert only if necessary. He stands between us and it. I'd say it's <sighs> necessary. Discretion, Altair. You mean cowardice? That man is our greatest enemy. And here we have a chance to be rid of him. Well, you have the already died on the way here. Of our it's boring. Well, let's now watch you it together, right? Third. Do not compromise the Brotherhood. I am your superior in both title <laughs> and ability. Man, I've you seen should know this better show than bunch already. Yes, plus I'm getting hungry. Let's go. Ah. <laughs> uh. Seems like you're burning. You're, the switch burning We're not the only ones with business here. Ah. Yeah, but it, like five ago, well, five years ago, this place was popping. Man. Whole families turned out to watch. And what is it you want? Blood. No! You know not the things in which you meddle, Azessa. I spare you only that you may return. I really wish that they would come out with a full-on remastered version of this game. He should flee now like, while he has the chance. With actual like what? gameplay? All of you will die. Well, like, similar to what they did with Assassin's Creed 3 and Liberation and stuff. At the very least, where they remastered the graphics. Because... Especially with how... They did, yeah. It came free with, uh... With certain co with, um... I don't remember if it was if you got like the gold edition of Odyssey or if it was just every copy of Odyssey you got a you would on you play you got a free um it was probably every copy because I got it Yeah, it's a full it's a full remaster of 3. Um and Liberation bundled into one. Um and they've also been remastering uh they also did um 4, I believe. And, uh, I think they did a four and rogue combination, which also has, uh, freedom, um, shit, the, I forget the name of it, the, the one that has Atawale, yeah, Freedom Cry, the one with Atawale, who is such a shame that he didn't get much more focus when he was an assassin. Yeah. Um, honestly, Atawale is... I don't know, I really like the the way that they tied together a lot of the story back in that era. Between yeah. Rogue, Unity, uh, AC3, and... Uh, four. Cry and and four. four, yeah. Um, it's, um, yeah, they really tied it all together and show Because it was all happening at around the same point in time. Um, they even connected somewhat to... <laughs> two. Showing what, um... Giving connections to Ezio. Um, I. Um. Altair, you've returned. They. Raouf. It is good to see you. I think they went into. I. I, I don't remember for sure, but I think they went into how. Uh, Ezio is related to. Edward. No doubt, he expects you. My thanks, brother. If I remember correctly, I don't remember for sure. On you as well. I. I don't think so. I do know that Edward does... is a descendant of Ezio, though. It's it's likely on account of the, you know, the ancient blood. Yeah. And on top of that, it's likely because of the, uh, 
<coughs> man horiness of Ezio Auditore da Firenze. Yes, he is absolutely a man whore. Yes, but he's such an amazing man whore. I'm not, I'm not gonna dispute that. Like, like, I'm straight, but I'd fuck him. Let's be real. I wouldn't go that far. <laughs> you know, one of the things, th randomly thinking about it, I don't remember, I don't remember if it'll actually let me right now, but there is a point, like, in, later in this game where you can just straight up assassinate these guys without them being hostile, like the random guards in the town, and you don't get, you don't get in trouble for it. <laughs> yep, right, well, okay, they do get mad, but... Okay, I regret many things. I have regrets! I was trying a thing! Leave me alone! <laughs> oh, the I regret thing. it! I'm listening to this before it happens on the screen, and it's quite amusing. I'm not here. You can go back to your post. Your friend will be back in like... At like 10 minutes when things respawn. I will say I really appreciated in Assassin's Creed, I think it was Brotherhood when they started like, oh, wait a minute, that's a pile of hay, let's stab it to make sure nobody's hiding in it. Well, the the, re the canon reason for that was Templar started leaking Assassin's tra tactics. <laughs> I don't know, like, it sounds to me like, like it was just like, yeah, I would hide in that. <laughs> Well, I mean, there is an element of that, too, but the, um, it's also, there's also the element of, like, by that point in time, the Templars were much more powerful within the Catholic Church, and so they were spreading information about how, of, that they'd learned of how to, def to fight assassins, and the stereotypes of what assassins would do in combat, and, and when running and hiding and stuff. see so i mean like yes it's a there's a level of i would hide there but it's also a level of the templars kind of rule the world at fully rule the world at that point basically that's true that is true i kind of miss the option to straight up blend while standing and just like folding your hands and and shit um i don't know how they would have done that in like Ezio's era but, uh, because, you know, if a guy was walking around heavily armed with his hands folded, you would definitely still pay attention to him, you know. But, um, I, I, I don't know how they would have uh, incorporated that, but I, th I wish there had been a manual blend option. Like, if you turned it on, you could do it or something. I don't know. Uh, I don't know how they could have gotten it to work, but I kind of miss it. Abbas, where are the others? Did you ride ahead hoping to be the first one back? I For anyone watching, stay hydrated! Glory. It's important. Silence is just another form of a sin. Have you nothing better to do? I bring word from the master. He waits I'm for not you in the quite library. looking forward to actually making my... Best so one, one crazy thing your about this to put your tongue to his boot that I'm playing... Another I told word you I'm and I'll put my blade to your throat. Yes. There'll be plenty of yeah, time for uh, that later. So, not, not only am I supposed to prepare the bodies and I... and... Uh, give sermons at the local chapel and everything like that. Uh -huh. But, like, you can take the bodies and turn them into zombies to do random labor for you. Necromancer! Yeah, and considering there's an Inquisition out looking for witches, I'm not sure why I'm doing that. It's not witchcraft, it's necromancy. There is a difference. Witchcraft... I don't know how they do it in the game, but witchcraft was specifically targeted towards women. It was a, a manner of sexism to keep the uh, keep women in line. And so I don't know where they're going to go with it in the in your game, but it's possible that they're taking that element of it, and if you're playing a male character, you can get away with it because you have a penis. Cool it with them hot takes, boy. <laughs> nah! I like them spicy. Spicy hot. Master. Come forward. It was also entirely uh, 
one of the king, whichever king it was, I don't I remember. You have recovered the um, treasure. there was some trouble, master. It was also the entire. Was there, there was one of them who was entirely of suppressing his gay side, to and so that's it's why he was going around killing a bunch of people. Who we are. This time it was not enough. What do you mean? I have failed you. The treasure. Lost I have too failed much. you. And Robert escaped. I send you my best. Am man. I trying to avoid the police? Girl, I'm, 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 I'm white. Unless you're talking about Howie's game. Apologies and excuses. I did. Do not speak. Not another word. This is not what I expected. We'll need to mount another the politics, force. Politics, James. I swear to you, I'll find <laughs> him. I'll go in. Bring it. No, you do nothing. Oh, politics! I can't read. It's fine. Where are Malik and Kadar? Aren't I trying to say avoid politics? No, I'm not trying no. to avoid politics. Not that. Yeah, no, I'm not going. I, I, I'm. 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 I love controversy <laughs> too much. Gone. Because of you, Robert threw me from the room. There was no way back. Nothing I could do. Oh. Because you would Oops. not heed my warning. All of this could have been avoided. Then I need to edit that. And my brother. <laughs> Note. My Note to self, edit chat around. rules. Your arrogance. I don't even remember what my chat Nearly? rules are. Nearly? I've watched your favorite fail to find. Here. Take it. Yeah, if you, it seems maybe, I've maybe today to stay off the politics, prison. just so you don't come off like a... I can talk about the politics, but you Master, can't. Ha <laughs> ha Yeah. No, just yeah, that's, that's fair. That's fair, yeah. So he seeks a battle. Yep, today I will. At least until I can edit my my chat settings. My chat rules. Go. Inform the others. I mean I could do it Fortress right now, I think. But I'd rather play the game. As for you, Altair, our discussion will have to wait. You must make for the village. It's just that it's Destroy playing the Assassin's universe. Creed, they kinda get very political about some things. And so it'll be really hard to, you know. <laughs> but like they don't get political political. Not like American politics. That's true. Nothing specific. Nothing but... highly divisive. Eh. Altair, it's good you've A come. bit. We need your... A bit divisive. What's happened? Templars. They attacked the village. Most of our people were able to get away. Most. But not all. What do you need me to do? Distract the Templars. Keep them occupied while I rescue those still trapped inside. As you wish. I probably did originally intend to stay out of politics with the with these streams, but I absolutely don't remember that. And thinking about it, it will be impossible for me to stay out of politics because, you know, fuck it. But I will try for this the remainder of this stream. Let me adjust my volume settings real quick, because I can barely hear you, Howie. It's okay, I'm just listing off random shit my character is. Ah, okay. Well, actually, I need to adjust some stuff as anyway. Uh, game audio down a bit. Discord stay. Just a bit more game audio. Um... Wrong button. There we go. All right. Who's the next person for me to kill? Use my fists. 
or not. Oh, come on. He was dead. There we go. Alrighty. Oh, wow, I did that way too soon. Did you just say get ended? Yes. Well, on the bright side, when it comes to the, the, the other two. I know what I'm doing now, I just need to write shit out. Good! I actually finally have, um, I actually am finally at a point where I'm close to being ready to start my own campaign, too. Um, I actually started writing out specifics for my first session and everything. I found a nice, uh, online, uh, website that will let me, uh, that let me build a map of the world. And things like that pretty great you linked that didn't you I think so I think I did or at least one of them I found several that were pretty decent but I, I found one that I liked the most um, and I I think I linked that into the discord that oh wow I don't think I've ever noticed exactly how many soldiers were pouring in through that gate before <laughs> holy crap wow yeah that's a lot I was going to jump in and say oh. like a very terrible VeggieTales reference, but do it. I'm not going to do that because it kind of doesn't make sense. But y'all in your campaigns, everyone's hosting a campaign. I feel left out. Well, you could join! Do you want to run instead of the new one? Do you really want to run something? Like, kind of. I feel like I need to like really hash out some things before I apply to wizards. Fair. What you, you could. What, let's give it a what, shot, eh? Really? What, we, yeah. what you could do. What you could what do you really is. Run your campaign? What you could do is you could set up a secondary thing, like on Friday nights or something, um, Friday where. Nights, I'm kind of doing something. Oh, fair. Um. <laughs> Hmm. Some other day, if there's time, and you could do either a D&D campaign or you could do a, uh, um, what's it called, uh, oh, that Monster's Hearts one. Oh, we're not doing Monster Hearts. Why not? <laughs> okay, because fine. Because one, I want to hash out the stuff that I wrote so I can Don't actually say, hey, Wizards, I've written like three campaigns in a kind of pseudo world. Get me a job. Oh, but fair. Fair, two, fair. I honestly Howie forgot that you were- I doesn't want to play a cringy teenager. <laughs> but, but it's fun. <laughs> it's <laughs> it is though. Y'all are much. And do so without hesitation. Um, there, are, I, I could send that list of uh, interesting non D and D RPGs that you could check out too, um, for some other time. Because I do kind of want to do like a one shot in something yeah, not D and D, like, like Monster Hearts, but just anything else would be available. You know. I very much would uh, my like I have a, a significant interest in Pathfinder, um, but that's probably largely because you like rules. I like character <laughs> creation. You'll have to go ahead without and this. rules for character creation. creation. I would not mind. I would not mind oh, playing please. something in Pathfinder. Rain death upon our um, I would not mind playing something in Pathfinder. However, um, if we did that. Well, not however, but if we did that, I would, um, I have a friend who loves Pathfinder and is very experienced with Pathfinder, 
um, as well as several of the older D and D editions, like three point uh, three point five or whatever it's called. Um, and I don't think I would want to do three point five. It does seem right up that same alley, but uh, it also seems like there's just so much for it. Right, but what I'm saying is I could potentially pull her in to play because she's been trying to convince me to do something not 5e because she doesn't care for 5e um you know if you and her get together and uh pathfinder is more of a fan alteration of 3.5 based on 3.5 but it's its own uh ip right yeah yeah i yeah i know that but like what i'm saying uh, I is was i was responding to to yvonne in the chat oh um i'm sorry I got distracted. It's fine. <laughs> Isn't Pathfinder just refined um, 3.5? I mean, ish, basically. Ish. Um, I'm, I'm Get fucked, Robert. Um, if you wanted to get together a group from here. Uh, for His Pathfinder, uh, I would be, be down for that. That's not he troubles us again. Okay. Um, basically, if you guys, if you find time and want to run a Pathfinder thing, I'm in, and I could probably convince her to be in as well. I am not confident enough in my knowledge of the rules to be uh, up to running I did as that, I was asked. especially no, since I'm already trying to run two campaigns. Oh, fair point, fair point. Um, okay, then I'll ask her if she's down for it, be, uh, for running one, because I absolutely have... We are nothing no clue how to run it either. Creed. All I know about Pathfinder is what it is. Which you That's about it. I know you. that, like, first and foremost, I know that intelligence isn't a freaking dumb stat because it, it counts for how many skill points you get per per thing, and there's more and of a skill leveling system. But that's about all I've got. To use it. If you are so I also know that 3.5. Then why did you kill the old man inside the temple? <laughs> he was innocent. He did not need to die. Your insolence knows no bounds. Yeah. They well, humble your heart, child, or I swear I'll tear it from you with my own hands. Almwalim went hard, that man. Gives us strength. <laughs> he really Hide did. In plain sight, let the people mask you such that you become one with the crowd. Do you remember? Because as I hear it, you chose to expose yourself. Drawing attention that, before uh, you'd struck. Having more narrow the third and final tenet. Uh, the worst of all your betrayals. Never um, compromise the Brotherhood. Like having, its meaning should you know, be obvious. A your actions must never bring harm upon how, us, direct or indirect. Uh, having a guess at how Yet your long selfish long act beneath Jerusalem placed us all in danger. Like that. A lot of Worse still, the you brought the enemy to our home. Every man we've lost today was lost because of you. Weirdly all encompassing, or just the DM has been. I'm sorry. Truly, I have. But I cannot yeah, abide a traitor. I am not a traitor. It's a weird mess. Your actions indicate otherwise. Yeah. And so you leave me. We could all, um, we could do a. Oh, what's it called? Deadwood? Where we're all cringy cowboys in the weird west? He's experiencing a far better adaptation than the other subjects. I'm still pulling him out. He's been in there way too long. Yeah, I have I have a list of non D and D um, games we that we could run one shots for at some point in time. Why don't we discuss this in the conference room. Um, Give Desmond a minute to stretch his legs. I really don't see. And I need to find Warren? that list. I don't remember where I put it, but I need to find it, and then I can send it. <sighs> Excuse me. That said. Um, my... I'll also Your... say that as far as Monster Hearts goes, urban fantasy was never my thing. Fair. And I was never... I never had any appeal to the likes of, say, Smallville. Mm. I, get, I guess I'm just down for really anything. Um, 
<laughs> I think my, my, my interests are, are unfairly narrow. Like, I don't... Like, okay, when it comes to things I watch, I'm a bit more... Or play, I'm a bit more picky. Like, play on video games, I'm a bit more picky. Um, like, I generally try to steer away from zombie media because I have... I don't generally care for zombies as a concept. And, um... Sure, they're fun to joke about and talk about and stuff, but I don't generally care for them as a concept. But... Oh, I would like to point out, real quick, we've reached the point where my game crashed first time two weeks ago, and it hasn't crashed. So, milestone, question mark? Um, anyway, uh, but yeah, it, so, I mean, that's just for things I watch, though. I Like, when it comes to... Um, I don't mind it as much. Like, I, I refuse to watch The Walking Dead. Um, when it comes to video games, depending on what they do with the zombies, I'm, I, I, don't, I don't care as much for, like, the classic shambling zombie type stuff. Now, if it was that, like, Halo with the Flood kind of did a zombie-esque thing, and that was okay because they kind of sci-fied it up a bit more. And it was an alien race type of a thing, at least my understanding of it. Um, and uh, but yeah, it's, it's, so I mean, it depends on what they do with the zombie. It also depends on what they do with the game as a whole. Um, on that note, I'm curious. We're how done do for today, Mr. Miles. Uh, I suggest uh, you return to your room and get some rest. Type deal. Like that angle on the zombie. Like it depends on the. There was a big dad that was a necromancer and, and stuff like that. I don't know. I've got I've had some ideas that can really work around that sort of thing. I mean, I, again, when it comes to tabletop, I'm much more, I'm much more, uh, flexible when it comes to the zombies. It's just, I think it's more the visual aspect of them brings it a bit more into my head. You know, it's like it's like people who have a phobia of spiders or something like it, it's more the if you see them type of a thing for some of them for some people i can't i'm not going to speak for everybody but for some people if you see the spider then that's when the phobia kicks in whereas so you're if really you um like Altair? yes and no uh what do you mean? if you uh i was supposed to be one if you're just but hearing about it and you're fine i was 16. So I mean, I think with the yeah, the with the tabletop, it would it would be I, it's different it's Messiah, I because only not so uh, it's just it just creepy. is. So necromancer on like a tabletop thing would be fine, but like if it's a video game or a show or a movie, then it's not like it creeps me out or grosses me out or anything like that. It, I, I don't have any kind of visceral reaction. I just eh, about it, and I don't really care for it. How we have to be prepared. No one ever came. Nothing ever happened. I'm gonna invade your Why personal space there, Lucy. Never leave the compound. Oh wow. Okay. Never mind. I take that back. Like Coppa field, Desmond. No Damn. There's a whole world out there you never get to see. Don't you miss your parents? Damn. No. Well, sheesh. As far as I'm concerned, they weren't my. Parents. I know, right? Like, I move him into a personal space, and then immediately his hand goes to the chest. Bruh. Calm down. I guess they were right. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to dredge up the past. It's all right. <laughs> Gives me something to think about. Try and get some sleep. We've got a long day ahead of us tomorrow. You should be ashamed of yourself, Desmond. Got a question for you before I turn in. Sure. How did they yeah, find it? Dead. I mean, <laughs> I haven't been anywhere Spoilers. near another assassin for ten years. Use your real name? Nope. Dude, you're not not before get today. To Credit cards? Cash line. only. Telephone? Six no years. one to call. Driver's license? Motor. You severely underestimate. An <laughs> Photo, fingerprint. This is a drug company. Well, now you can actually what does Abstergo have to do with the DMV? Yeah, exactly. I am going to stick to the two-hour uh, thing, at least as much as possible. Can't talk about it. But yeah, no, it. You really have severe under. Um, Percenting these games. That's gonna take time. Not much, actually. I mean, for th for some of the bigger games, like okay, um, this is actually a good point to actually talk about it, um, because no conversation is happening in the game. Um, <laughs> okay, so 
for the early games, the stuff where you have to find the flags, find the feathers, find the uh, what are they called? Like the Mister E citizens or whatever the E citizens or whatever in Liberation thing, things like that. Things that show up on in the uh, the sink, not the sink, the oh, what is it called? The the sink bar things that that are like, oh, you can grab all of these or grab all of these. That's gonna be those are what I'm gonna focus on. It's not like I'm going to go for every little tiny chest and everything, um, unless it specifically has some kind of achievement thing for it. That said. I'm, when it gets to the bigger games, where there is a lot of random loot and stuff like that, I'm not going to be focusing as much on the 100% aspect of it, um, given that um, there's just so much, and at the with because of how much it is, they stop rewarding you for accomplishing it. So, like in this game, yes, there's a lot of those flags, but the flags give there is that little one of those gene things about all the different flags just like there is for the in two where you get uh, where you get that one cape for all the feathers and stuff like that um and uh so those are what i'm going to be mainly focusing on like when i get to um Oh, what is it? Uh, when I get to or spe specifically when I get to Origins and Odyssey, I'm going to be playing the new game plus modes of those, where because I've already completed all of everything else. I've got the best equipment, best uh, leveled up everything. So that way, I will just be plowing through the storyline and side missions on new game plus, um, and like, uh, but yeah, like Black Flag has all those chests everywhere where you can gain money and stuff and it has all those hunting quests and things there will be when it gets to those games i'll probably do some of the stuff off screen like i'll probably do some of the hunting off screen just because the visualizations of the hunting can get kind of a bit gruesome especially when you're doing the whaling stuff um so i'll probably be doing that type of stuff off screen but for the most, uh, but for like the specifically the early games where you have the flags and the feathers and the stuff like that, anything that shows up as a completionist type of a thing, that's what I'm going to be going for. Um, but yeah. Anyway. Aren't you tired? All right. So it is currently three thirty. That means we are actually at about halfway point of the stream. Hey. Cool. And you Damn have it, done locked the door. <laughs> I've done the tutorial in the intro and killed Altair. It's fine. Yeah, yeah. see, it, you, you haven't even properly started the game yet. That's fine. It's fine. You're impatient is what you are. <laughs> I'm telling you these games take longer than you might think. And I'm telling you these games really don't. And I can't even change my clothes. If you've played, at least if you've played them as often as I have, because this is like my sixteenth time playing Assassin's Creed One, um, or something like that. I don't remember the actual count. This is my first time playing it on the UPlay version because I had the uh, the disc way back when. Um, gotta say that's a little creepy. And I I would play it because I couldn't afford Assassin's Creed Two. Um, I We're would play it walking. over and over Not and over yet. and over and over We've and over. We've got a lot again. of work to do. Because I loved I it. To kill today. So don't be so cavalier. Your ancestors yeah. almost had the right idea, Mister Miles. If the deaths of a few people, evil people, no less. Hey, Avon, you still in chat? Thousands more. Well, it seems a small sacrifice. What do you mean almost? They didn't go far enough. To use a rather tired analogy, corruption is no different than cancer. Cut out the tumors, I guess she's not still but fail to treat depending the on how and, delayed well, you're buying time it is. at best. There's no true change to be had without comprehensive um, systemic intervention. You keep bringing up the how are the assassins the education, good guys education, thing, education, and they actually do go into it in this game. It's not easy. In the discussion and between Desmond and uh, You've got a this guy switch. whose name I'm forgetting. What is it? Um, <laughs> now that it's. 
basically he tell he go, he philosophizes a bit when conversations with Desmond about uh, about the uh, Templars' methods and and their purpose and stuff like that, and ultimately it really boils down to um, the ends justify the means type of stuff, and whether the but only if the end is worthy of the uh means type of a thing so like the assassins their end that they're going for is freedom for everybody true freedom um and the templars their goal is control have a seat on the animus desmond no no they're it is very much less a freedom versus control thing and very much more a order versus uh, law. Sorry, sorry, order versus chaos thing. And you can see, especially in Assassin's Creed Rogue and Unity, Sit the reversal down. of the role of good guy versus bad guy. I mean, uh, Yvonne says, I feel like it was only the first two games or so that make the Templars seem villainous. No question mark uh no um in the modern day ish but no and part of that has to do with the departure of the point of the series the series was supposed to end with three three was supposed to be the last game and if i remember correctly the guy who was in charge of the assassin's creed series left at three and so but the but U ubisoft was like we want more and so they kept pushing for it um, I need you to sit down on the animus. And I don't want to sit down on the animus yet. I'm talking to my friends. Leave me alone. Um, and uh, so they they tried to figure out ways they could continue the storyline without. Right. And yeah, it makes sense that Ubisoft would sque down. squeeze the lifeblood out of a story. It does because it makes the money, but also because it's a beloved series. And not everybody was happy with with three as the end of the series. So I mean, they kind of, you know. But anyway, um, they also left. If they left three as the end of the series, they left a lot of uh, plot on. Uh, they left a lot, th a lot of things hanging because they never really resolved anything. It's just we saved the world, okay, but we still have you know the Templars, and now we have Juno, and and and. Um, but basically they have, they ran into the problem with, how to sit, Mr. Miles. I swear to God. Okay, fine. If I sit down, will you shut up guys? Okay. Um, Right, because that event, they, what they ran into was they ran into a, we need a reason to the story for the story to continue. And then they ran into um, people, a lot of very vocal people. Well, personally, I don't think it's as many as it seems like. But a, some vocal people not wanting the modern aspect to the games anymore. And, uh, well, they never wanted it, but anyway. Um, and uh, they ran into a bunch of stuff that and they kept trying to please the crowd. And it ended up with things getting a little bit more convoluted than they initially intended partially because they had lost uh, they they didn't know where they were going after three um they so they introduced the whole juno thing and then that got re when people were tired uh, people didn't want when, uh, when people started more complaining about the modern day storyline take oh, taking precedence over the the past aspects um which you know whatever um the uh that's when they kind of relegated Juno and her plot line to mostly to the books and stuff. So like, I don't remember if I I don't remember if it's actually been resolved yet or not. But like, there's a new modern day sage and there's a new and Juno there's a cult that follows Juno that is fighting both the Templars and the Assassins, and it, it's led by Desmond's son. I would say spoilers, except I really doubt that it's going to come into play in any of the future games. Um, and various things like that. Um, so basically what happens is they introduce stuff in the games, 
and then they're like, well, crap, what do we do with it now? Because, you know, we don't want to bring a resolution to it, because then we feel like we have to end the games, and we don't, we want to keep leeching them for money. Um, so, capitalism, but yeah. that's back to politics. Something, something, burn down Ubisoft! No, don't burn down Ubisoft! No, they actually make some really good games. I love, I love, um, some of their, at least some of their good games. Assassin's Creed is an amazing series. It's an amazing series that has lost its heart. They I wouldn't go that far. As soon, as, soon as they lost Rebecca and Sean, <laughs> and all charm went out of the series. No, they lost, they lost their funny bone. <laughs> they didn't lose their hearts. Their heart they lost in three Start with Desmond um, and is brought has been brought back with uh, Layla because um, I really like Layla in Origins and Odyssey I really like her and I they've introduced some concepts I think I've talked to you about this before but they've introduced some concepts that I'm just like come on uh, come on bring this is a really good concept and you could do a lot of stuff with it and just stretch it out bring it bring it bring it but i don't think they will because they would have slept the sleep of the dead dude you are if on you call me dramatic i'm nowhere near as dramatic as elm walim you've slept the sleep of the dead jeez it is not enough to end the violence one man commits upon another. Um, real quick, do you mind? I, it's, I feel like it's getting a bit dark in here. Should I turn on another light? I am dramatic. I'm not saying I'm not dramatic. I'm just saying I'm not as dramatic as Al Mualim. Um, Howie, can you check the stream to see how dark my camera is? Overconfident. Were you not the one to say that nothing is true? Okay, okay. Because I... Well... Well, Baby Yoda deserves to be able to be made out, so... No! No! I do not need to go to prison for making out with a baby alien. But he deserves to be made out in the, in the light. You deserve to be able to see Baby Yoda and the Assassin's Creed necklace hanging in his face. You see you have been stripped of your positions. Rank as well. You are a novice. I mean, a child. really? You were on the day you first joined I guess. Order. I guess you can. I guess it's just the shadow that makes it. You can only see the lighting of it. Uh, I tried. I tried. First, you must prove to me you remember how to be an assassin. Oh, baby Yoda. What the? F so you'd have me take a life? He's a no. soap opera character. <laughs> For now, you're to become a student once again. What? What's the what There's the frick no for? Probably the. Uh, you got auto modded. Track your targets <laughs> for you, but no more. From today uh, on, you will track them yourself. The if this is what you wish. It is. Then tell me what it is that. Yvonne says she got auto modded. We have been betrayed. Someone yeah, was. Is it because you? Robert de Sable, one of our own. <laughs> you must find him and bring him here for questioning. We need more information, Yvonne. Ah, but that's just it. I've given you all I will. The rest is up to you. I have been demoted. Weapon lost. Sword. Weapon lost. Hidden blade. You've been demoted. Weapon lost. Short blade. Ability lost. Counter kills. Weapon lost. Throwing knives. You've been demoted. Ability lost. Tackle. I love that they lost the ability to tackle. It's like, oh no, I cannot physically lunge myself at another person anymore. I always kind of interpreted it as like, wow. Dude, check out your, your, your stream <laughs> controls. You, you have moderator controls, right? Uh, yeah, I do. Um. Yeah, check that out, because... Let me see. The problem is I'm trying to handle chat through my phone so that I don't have to alt tab too often. Nice. Um, but I don't, and so I don't know really how to do a lot of that. Um, Can you make me a mod? I could, actually, maybe. Um, actually, you know what? Hold on, let me just alt tab. Because if you 
Um, give me a mod. Uh, I'll do what I can when I'm around. Uh, they think she's talking too fast. She, so you're, yeah, it's a, it's a, it's a counter spam thing. Um, I don't think that's something you have to worry about right now. Probably not, but still. Uh, let's see here, channel and videos. This is going to be riveting for YouTube people when they see it later. <laughs> let's watch Jamie mess with his mod settings. Uh, where is the auto mod thing? Yeah. Oh, that. Well, I can change my chat rules now. Ha. <clears throat> uh, chat rules changed. Um, let's see here. Roles manager. Ha. <laughs> um. Add a roll. Howie, what's your Twitch name? Um, I'll, tr I'll type in the chat real quick. It's it's a weird combination of letters. It, it's a keyboard bang? You just slammed your face on your keyboard and that was what you took? Ah, okay. S-T. I keep trying to read that as strategist or something like that. Yeah, that that's... Strategy scien scientist? Stargate scientist. Oh! S T R G T. From back in the day S when I was C trying to make a, a, an email address. Um, Moderator. I, it might have been with Yahoo or something like that. You are now a moderator. Congratulations. I have swapped the mod view. Alright, it looks like I'm all caught up for. Oh, the video was canceled. Video was canceled? No, my video down. It's on my end. Okay. Cause I was getting that earlier too. I, I was getting that earlier too with my um, with my Twitch stream. I'm still coming through, all right, right, Ivan. getting Yvonne's chats. But you're not getting the actual thing. No, I've got a big black box saying the video download was cancelled. Please try again. Error number 1000. Yeah, I, I've been getting that too. On my end. So maybe... Well, add that to the note of things, the list of things to look into. Twitch error code 1000 video download was cancelled. Anyway, um, well, now, now you have moderator controls, so, alright, um, So I can help you out with the chats, but, uh, not with the video. <laughs> it's okay, you don't, you weren't watching anyway. Uh, I was peeking over every now and then when you were like, oh no, oh no, I'm sorry! <laughs> <laughs> I regret everything. All right, let's see here. Flag there. Up the ladder is flag two. Has he gone mad? He's climbing a ladder. God forbid. Uh, let's see here. Flag, I did always flag, find flag. that one particularly odd. It's the. I mean, it's the whole. You're. It, it's if you're running thing. It, it's the. It's because you're in the high profile mode when you do it. Um, if you're doing it while if you're doing it while in low profile, they won't make a fuss. Uh, I see. Okay. I thought it was because like it only ever happened when I was scaling things. Yeah, and it's the scale. It's because when you're high profile and climbing a ladder, it regi Ooh, it I almost just died. Uh, it registers itself as a scaling, as as if you're beginning to scale. God save him! He's gone um, mad. Okay, well, I can't go in there. To be honest, you don't usually see people running up a ladder, so... Right, exactly! So... Oh, come on. Yeah, so, I mean, you know, it's... it's an, Or dropping off the side of a, of the, of a ladder by accident. <laughs> um, 
Okay, so I got those two two flags. Can't get that one. Can't get that one. Yet. Safety and peace, Altair. You're in Safety my way. And peace. Yes, Al Mualim has asked that I assist you. Huh. I wonder if it's an error involving, error involving mod settings may, at the moment. I have no desire to huh. obey. Then be quick. The assassin have many tools at their disposal. Yes, yes. We can eavesdrop. We can pickpocket. Or we can use violence to intimidate. Good, you remember. So you'd have me walk amongst the others and learn what I can about the traitor? Yes. Begin by going to the village market. That's where we first spotted the traitor. You know who it is? Perhaps. Then give me a name and let's be done with it. That's not the way it works. Now go. And remember, begin your search in the village market. <laughs> begin your search in the village market. All right. I'll tell you, the original badass. I think I said that last time too, but I will always say it because Altair is the original badass. Well, I mean, timeline-wise, technically speaking, Bayek and Cassandra or Alexios came first at this point, but... Off the thing. Flag right here. Alright. He's going to hurt himself. He's going to hurt himself, says another assassin. Come on, drop. There you go. God he's save him. Mad. He's gone mad. God save him, he's gone mad. Um I love I do love some of their their call out lines. Dragon Ball Z? Not while listening to you. True. I mean, you can multi- since the stream is not actually playing for you, you can. Again, not while listening to you. I, you could mm. mute me, you don't have to listen to me. Well, in that case, why would I bother being here? Because you my friend? No, I'm just here to tell you how wrong you are about everything. <laughs> well, I mean, there's that too. But, you know. I keep- I'm still trying to learn the fucking controls, because I keep trying to push C for drop rather than shift. Such a strange man. Let's go back and get those other two that, or the, yeah, the other two, the, or the other one. One or two. I don't remember. <sighs> yep. Yeah. These specifically I'm, I'm using to, uh, help my muscle memory remember how the game is played. Because I'm a lot more rusty than I thought I was, or was hoping I would be, at least. You better not cause any trouble. Should have played with a controller. Man, huh? man, I can't do controller gameplay. I mean, I could, but I, 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 I can't. I can't. When will you I can't. Like a fool? <laughs> there are some games where I cannot operate well without a controller. I'm the other way around. There are many games where I can't operate well without a keyboard and mouse. Um, like, I've I've been so behind on the various consoles. I only recently got a PS3. Um, and, uh... The, um... Yeah, it... So I've been... I picked up a bunch of games that I'd already played and beaten numerous times on PC like the Arkham series, the Batman Arkham series, 
and I... The muscle memory still kicks in for the controller, but I miss, miss, drastically miss the keyboard uh, and mouse. Um, oh, come on. I'll tear. There you go. Um, but yeah, it... There was... Um, there was actually one game that I can think of that... Um, that I was playing on, that I tried playing first on, uh, PC, and then I swapped to, then I wanted, I wished I had sw could get it on console, um, and it was actually one of the Sonic games, um, Sonic Generations, and that was because it doesn't use the mouse at all, and so I had to, um, I, I had to fiddle with it. Oof. I always... I keep forgetting that I can fucking eagle dive into that haystack. Oh, well. Whatever. Um, Alright, so I got... I got... Let's see. I got those two. That one. Uh, I got the one that's up here on the left. I got... Um, I got that one over, that's over there. I got that one that's right there. Um, I got that one. There's a lot of these flags that I am more or less doing from memory. Um, I do have a, uh, map that I'm referencing for if I don't remember exactly where it is, but... Um, so far, I'm actually running off of memory. See, I actually have a controller hooked up to my PC. I got myself one of those. I got myself a wireless PS3 controller, because uh, I am that kind of person. Um, I prefer uh, PlayStation to Xbox, though I have no real grump with uh, it. What is that? Um, though I have no real grump with the Xbox at all. Um, but, uh, yeah, I, so I did get myself one of those. It doesn't fully work all the time. Like, I have to go in and do a decent bit of fiddling to get it to work properly. But, um, the, uh, but I, it, it, I, it does, it does, it does work occasionally. <laughs> and, um, that's how I finally was able to... That Sonic game I mentioned, it was... That's how I was finally able to uh, complete that game. Um, I have since actually found a way to program... Uh, to, to mess with the controls uh, in the game so that I could actually, you know, use my keyboard in such a way that it was comfortable and familiar. Got that one, got that one, got those two, that one, that one, that one, that one, that one, and that one. Um, okay. The Masai F flags are actually some of the easiest ones to get, just because they're meant to be, if you're looking for them. Um, such a strange man. You live in a, in a town run by assassins, and you think random person climbing and scaling and parkouring all over the place is strange. I think the other assassins kind of keep low profile most of the time, or at the very least, stay in low profile instead of, sc instead of scaling buildings. I, I guess. I guess that's fair to say. Um. Oh, come on, mouse. Do I need to plug you in? Let me Let me check my mouse battery real quick. Uh, no? Then what is... Whatever. Anyway. Um, yeah, that, that is kind of fair to say, um, now that I think about it. Because, you know, it's the whole don't draw attention to the Brotherhood thing. Um, which Altair got stabbed to sleep the sleep of the dead. 
<laughs> and when they aren't, the, and the thing is, when they aren't uh, being in low profile, they find a way to low profilely get themselves onto the roofs, and then they go into high profile. Um. All right. Let's see. Where where is my objective? My objective is over there. Okay, so let's just. What is he doing? Oh, was that? Nope, that wasn't it. I saw a. Oh, there it is. Is that it? Nah, whatever. Um. God save him! He's gone mad. I should stop Wait, that. Why is <laughs> voice meter go away? Okay. Um. Uh, My objective is over here. Eavesdrop, sit on a nearby bench. Oh, for the days when you had to actually sit on a bench to eavesdrop, rather than covertly follow someone around. I mean, by my recollection, Unity had that. Yeah, they did still have it in some of the games but like there was a lot of them where you had to actually the follow the, the people around while they talked then you must tell al muallim yeah. i will say i can't was a good masoon did not act alone someone inside the fortress helped him what right you say? yeah it had it did have a lot of glitches when it first came out but they released a fix and it fixed a lot of the problems um, but the weaver delivered him a letter just before personally I wish uh, my biggest complaint with unity was the multi the the actual specifically weaver. multiplayer missions um, I wish that they were hiding for fear of being in chronological in order <laughs> Probably in so that you could so, uh, to their difficulty level so like one of the earliest uh, diff one of the easiest lowest difficulty missions is in um, is in uh is chronologically like after the story the main storyline or something like that where you're it's like you're following napoleon around or no you're dealing with um oh the, the it's the bread riots i don't remember um but like you're uh it's one of the earliest ones and it's not until after the main storyline or pretty late in the late main storyline that it takes place chronologically and so it's if you're trying to actually follow the timeline, as I do, because I'm a history nerd, um, it uh, it gets frustrating and annoying. Um, and yeah. Okay, so I have to go over here to pickpocket somebody. Oop! Didn't mean to do that. There we go. Um. Okay. Okay. Um, I think, if I'm where I think I am, there should be another flag somewhere up here, I think. Yes, 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 right here. Bingo. Alright. 14 out of 20, only 6 more to go. Two of which I can't get until much later in the game. In fact, three of which I can't get until much later in the game, I think. Um... I do. Uh, one of the things I hope that they do in Valhalla when they when it comes out is that they do a lot more to actually connect um, the hidden ones from Origins to the assassins of um, Masayef. And I'm not just talking like. Um, 
I'm not just talking like uh, how did uh, how they got there or anything like that, but but like um, how did the uh, there was a specific specifically a question that I had in my mind and now it's gone. Uh, <laughs> whatever. Anyway, I hope I hope they do a lot more to bridge the gap between Origins and One. Is what I'm trying to say. Um, uh, I don't see that as even being possible in the least, seeing as how it's way out of the way geographically, versus, uh, and they would have to go all the way back to where they were, and it takes place chronologically, like, a long time after? Valhalla? No! Valhalla, Valhalla is before the Crusades. Is it? Is that the name? Yeah, pretty sure. If I remember correctly, it is. Um, the, uh, there we go. I'm seeing, uh, set in 837. Yeah, and the cru this crusade was in, like, 1300. The, this was the third crusade, which I'm pretty sure is, like, 1300s. Yeah, it's it's much later than Origins, but it's bef I'm pretty sure it's still before one. Yeah, it takes place in the third in the twelfth century, it looks like. Yeah. So eleven ninety one. So yeah, you are right, eh? Yeah. Surprise, um, surprise. I will I will admit I would prefer to see a an assassin uh, branch offset uh, rather than something that's tied into the main line. I would really li love to see something far more off the side and then have the, ma the actual modern day story be like, oh crap, there's other assassins out there. We need to find them and connect with them. Well, the... Um... I mean, that would require them to actually do a modern day focused game and i don't think they will um well no but like you know with the same degree of of interest that uh that layla had in ac origins you know right and i mean i wish i do wish that they did a lot more with the um with the modern day storyline in fact, personally, I wish that they would do a uh, modern day that was a, a game that was entirely about set in the modern day. Um, um I, I would like to see Watch Dogs tied into it directly. Like, yes, directly. yes, that too. That's where where my next thought was going. Like beyond just a side mission where um you kill a modern day Templar because the assassins ask you to. Um. I would wi I I do wish that they would uh, you know do a lot more with that, um, and uh, the um, they could do it they could do it um, it's just I don't think they will. What I would really find interesting like oh I I do think that Watch Dogs was originally uh, conceived of as a modern day Assassin's Creed game. I, th I think it was, too. Oh, there it is. Um, and that's the last flag I can get for now. Yay! Don't mind me. I'm just, uh... I'm, I'm just, I'm just gonna go over here. No problem. Anyway, um... But yeah, I kind of had this idea where it was like a modern-day choose your faction type of uh thing where you could choose to be a member of dead sec or you could choose to be a member of the assassins or you could choose to be a templar or you could choose to be um listen i see what i can do oh blue a member of bloom industries um and like all four like in in kind of like a star wars the old republic uh mmorpg style thing um and, uh, he, uh, where they, where all each, which, where each faction has their own storyline 
that they that you can follow through and they all intersect to some degree and work together on if they're allies if they're uh canonically are allied because bloom is canonically an uh an associate of of uh abstergos um where where they are they're not just they are business rivals but they do work um they do a lot of they do work together because bloom is a um they, they have a uh, uh bloom specializes in a specific thing and abstergo takes um takes um like Watch Dogs 2 did a lot to um I see the way you look at me. to ex the to expand say. things um when it comes to Bloom I'm and the it's and Dead Second stuff. Um so you should definitely give that a, a look. Plus it fixed a lot of the problems that one had. Um not that there were a lot of problems in my opinion with one because I loved watched the first Watch Dogs. I loved Aiden as a character and that kind of a thing. But eh, They don't direct the, the storylines don't directly connect. Aiden makes an appearance, but he's not the focus. What's mostly the focus is the organization DeadSec. More than anything else. And, um... Like, I... From what I've been able to gather, it's like they're building a worldwide uh network of these specialized hackers who can do all these amazing things uh and yeah it's It's not necessarily required, because they don't exactly... They reference it, but they don't do it in such a way where you need to know what they're talking about. Why did you betray us? And who do you serve? Type of a thing. We serve the Templars. You should too. Their cause is just... We? Jamar. He told me of their plans. Asked me to open the gate. You betrayed us. We, who called you brother and kept you safe from harm. I did what I believed was right. And if you must kill me for it, so be it. I am not afraid to die. Your fate not is not for me to, to decide. It's Al Mualam who will judge. Fast forwarding memory to a more recent one. <sighs> you stand accused of betraying our brotherhood and opening the way for our enemies. How do you answer to these charges? I deny nothing. I'm proud of what I did. My only regret is that they failed. I offer you a chance to repent, to renounce the evil in your heart. It is not <sighs> evil in my heart, but truth. I will not repent. I would not mind a game. I, I, they may have actually done this because there were a couple mobile games that took that focused on Altair and this era, and I don't remember. And, and I think one was a prequel to this. Have earned the right to carry a um, once more. And I would love, but I would love to see one that focused on the rise of Al Mualim and how he became what he is in this game. Or fear. These men can be saved. Others suffer from corrupted wills, their minds poisoned and twisted. These men must be destroyed. Soon enough, you'll know what sort of man Jamal is. I've passed your test. What now? <laughs> right, and, I, and I'm not like where you play as him, but I'm talking like similar to what they did with Rogue and Achilles. Nine names adorned. Nine where Achilles is just kind of there, and he's in the background, and he plays a part, and he grow, and you see how what leads him to become who he is in Assassin's Creed Three. You will find them. Um. I feel like in doing Achilles so, you will sow the, the seeds of peace, both for the region and for they, yourself. They do a decent bit of, at least semi-background, 
telling how, why he becomes the re, re, the reclusive. Um, Have you any questions? Leave me alone. I'm I'm done with this life type of person that he is in three. Um, and it's he is the one who caused the events of Rogue, but he. Uh, uh, there is a there are events that happen i don't remember how much they focus on them um but they there are events that happen that lead directly into uh, like you can see why he's the way he is if you believe it best and i kind of wish they would do that for al-mualim because when they from context uh it sounds like al-mualim was really no different than an enlightened altair after uh you answer not only to after you, this game, how Altair is after this well. game, like when he show how he shows so up in be. how he is when he shows up in Take Revelations. Your equipment and go. Um, Prove that you are not yet lost to us. And I would love to see how he goes from that to this basic religious zealot type of a thing. Man, I really want to have a hidden blade in real life. Those things are freaking badass. Eh, I'm not too attached to it. Other than literally. <laughs> Other than literally, I'm not too attached to it. Alright, so I think I can... I... Nah, I can just use my pinky. And here is the next last flag I can get. Alright, so I have two flags left to get. And they are all behind this... Massive gate that doesn't unlock until, like, halfway through the game. If I remember correctly. Whee! Alright. Ah, training. Altair, or tutorial. it seems my students do not fully understand what it is to wield a blade. Perhaps you could show them what you know. Perhaps you can show them what you know. If they remastered the, if they did actually remaster this game, I do wish that they would um, uh, revoice Altair's uh, like they did in Revelations, so that he uh, actually has an Arabic accent, like he does in Revelations. The work of a master. Yeah. Um, I'm willing to accept, uh, oh, that's my students. Is how we all Yeah, and I mean, they do kind of get, go into that a bit. Um, but I still wish they'd actually... Um, you must be busy, I do wish that they'd actually, uh, would go into it. Alright. So we got about half an hour left of the stream. And... This is kinda decently a good point to stop. Although I'm, yeah. Although I'm not certain that I actually want to stop right now. Well, 20 minutes left. Um, we'll have to. I'll have to go in and check settings and stuff to and see what Google tells me about the the error that popped up. The what was it a thousand or something? I have it written down somewhere. Yeah, error number one thousand. The, the ah. video download. Came. Yeah, I I'll need to see what Google says about that to see if it's anything that was on Twitch's side or on, on my side, because it's a good thing that viewers can still watch the one that I currently still have. Um. Uh, it looks like on my thing from the moderator, we've got yourself, Ivan, and somebody titled Commander Root. Really? I'm not seeing any of that. I see one viewer listed in my in my mobile moderator thing. But hey, welcome. Yeah, um, it it might not be counting me if uh, I don't know. It, it, you said his name was Commander Root. Yep, Commander Root. Well, Commander Root. Um, if I know you in real life, I'm sorry I don't know your username. Uh, but welcome, if you're still here. Sorry it took us this long to realize that you were in here. Uh, they've been here for a decent little while. Uh, I honestly don't know if 
<laughs> Perhaps the uh, <laughs> why? Super lit, laggy with the, the chat and all that. Yeah. Hello, yep, yep. YouTube. You don't know yeah. this. Yeah, well, hello, YouTube. You're going to have a completely different... I mean, I don't know what his real name is, so it's fine. Um, and I feel like our conversation has enough context that they can... That YouTube viewers will be like, okay. Because <laughs> it's not like... Like, I... I, I make it clear when uh, when I in the description of the videos and stuff that it's a uh, that it's oh, yeah, a um, like when you get super popular and super famous, yeah. all of your Reddit fans will be trying to dox it so they can ask you to ask you to ask you to ask you to ask But it's fine. I don't need to know who he is. For all, for for when that inevitably happens, apparently because that's a thing I'm destined to do. Um. <laughs> Uh, I, any future fans who are seeing this and want to go dox Cap, uh, Commander Root, not Captain, don't promote him, Commander Root, um, don't, don't dox people, that's bad, it's a bad thing, don't do that, be nice to people, love each other, love each other, hydrate, wear masks in public, and wash your hands. First time, first footstep outside of Maseyev, short of the intro section. I'm officially in the kingdom. Um, and let me take this time to actually check on Twitch to make sure everything was okay on my end of things. OBS. OBS, you still good? Yes, OBS is still good. Um, Alright. Um, what am I looking for? This button. That's the button I'm looking for. All right, and uh, kingdom. Yep. Now, kingdom is the one that's going to be the most annoying to find all the flags because there are a hundred of them, literally one hundred flags, and it's a lot. It's a lot. <laughs> yep. It's not. I'm hesitant to call it like an open world section uh, because you don't really have much control over any instance, uh, any area that's not specifically mapped out. So like if I pull up the map, um, I haven't unlocked it because of my eagle vision and uh, my uh, viewpoint stuff yet. But you can if you're looking at the map, you can vaguely see these areas that are lighter than the other areas. And those are the only areas you can get. To, that you can actually stand on that I'm aware of. I mean, without breaking the map or anything like that. Um, and so it, I, I'm hesitant to actually call it an open world. I mean, it might technically be an open world, but I, I'm hesitant. Personally, I'm hesitant to call it that um, because it's not like I can be like, oh, I will go, I will go climb that mountain because it's there. Um, one of my favorite side effects of playing this game <laughs> is when you see a picture of a place in real life, or, um, a, uh, or I you hear someone... That. Well, there's, like, I mean, okay, that that's the, my other favorite side effect. Um, but my one, my, my favorite favorite side effect is the one where it's like, someone's talking about having gone to Jerusalem or something like that, and you're like, I've been there! <laughs> um... And it's like, wait, no, I haven't. Not, not, not in person, but I've been there in a video game, and it was supposedly hyper realistic. So I've been there back in the Crusades, kinda. <laughs> and then you stand there as they're judging you, and it's fine. <laughs> um, but the other one that you were talking about is the anytime you're wandering around the real world, and you're just like, and you see a building in, with, like obvious climbable walls and shit like that You're, the, the, well assassin's creed definition of obvious climbable walls <laughs> it's like hmm, yes i could climb that and then you just start mapping your route up to the roof <laughs> i love the assassin's creed series um you know what i'm gonna do i'm gonna start a fight 
na 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 I wanna start a fight. I haven't fought anything in a minute. <laughs> I mean, they were there. <laughs> Are you sure that it wasn't just uh, as he does? <laughs> I could hear that one. That one I heard. <laughs> there is a flag here. I know it is because it's always the first flag you get in the kingdom. Where is it? It's like right... Zoom into the map with this ancient technology. It's like right there. I, I know it. I know it's at the end of this Y intersection. Where the fuck is it? The, is it not spawned in yet? Do I not get... No, 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 I can. I can. Because I wouldn't be able to get the Masaya flags if I couldn't get the Kingdom flags yet. Hmm. Well. Hmm. A lot of this stream has been me cl has been me collecting flags. So, you know. <laughs> Where? Whatever. Fuck it. Out. Get get off the tree. There you go. Add on Z. To I believe it's Jerusalem. No, it's Damascus. Damascus first. Ride like the wind, bullseye. My life ends now because I ran into a restricted area on purpose. And I don't have counter kill yet, so I'm having a lot of fun right now with proper. Ooh. Okay. Well, I regret everything now. So, bye. I have regrets. Well, I bl blame Twitch, alright? Blame Twitch. It's Twitch's fault that you, you can't see these regrets. I love that I'm being followed by the horse. <laughs> so, like, I looked behind me, right? And I'm being chased by a bunch of guards, of course. And behind the guards, they're being chased by my horse. Damn it. Oops. Oh, hi. Oh, I have regained health. I can fight you again. Come on. And I think I just got killed. Oh, nope! Yep, now I'm dead. Oh! Still no! There we go. Now I'm dead. <laughs> Oops! Oops! <laughs> it's really not! Keep getting into fights and dying every time you get bored. Eventually, I didn't happen. die. Not going to have saved for a long time. I mean, this game auto saves, dude. I know this one does. I'm sure all the others do too. But that's all the Assassin's Creeds auto save. They all auto save. I want to climb this building, so I'm gonna climb this building. Cl climb. There we go. Uh huh. Is the fact that like uh, how do I put it? Un so connected to your house and the church and the morgue and are it is like this underground series of uh, I hesitate to use the term catacombs. It's more like a shared basement where all your research is done, all your embalming is done. 
more than one is done with quick access according to the town and the village. Mm -hmm. the village, the village. I'm sorry, the town and the village are just I never understood. <laughs> Pardon me. And it because it's condensed down here. Mm -hmm. Um and the amount of fences up on the overworld, it ends up being a lot easier to get around via the shared basement. So you end up feeling like that, like the the crypt keeper, the guy who just sort of appears out of nowhere. Like, wait a minute, I just saw you back on your property. How did you get here before me? Also, <laughs> you know, <laughs> secret passages out into the middle of the town in some where random warehouse, and just sort of appearing out of basements. Basically, there's an aesthetic that they're fully going for, and they're oh, leaning absolutely. into it. And it works out because it's, it's a shortcut everywhere. Right. Similar. It sounds like it's similar to the uh, underground passages in three. Not really. Since three allows you to fast travel. Yeah, but th that's only because you could under unlock those underground passages. In at, at least in a couple of the towns. You basic it was yeah they were faster to grab a horse and ride them wherever you were. Right. And it was also very much a um very much a uh these are a thing that exists in real life, so we're that existed in real life in history, so we're gonna actually make a reference to them and have you run around in them. But we're not gonna actually do anything with them. Because Oops. <laughs> um Actually, uh, instead of actually continuing on to Damascus or going and starting another fight, because it is 4.23, my time, we have seven minutes left of the stream, I am actually going to go ahead and pretty much call it there. Um, so, it's a little early, but I mean, I said 4.30-ish, and personally, that's fine, I don't, I don't, I'm fine with that so yeah um or i could just sit here and talk for six minutes while we stare stare at altair uh <laughs> but i think that would be a lot more boring um so thank you for um coming to the stream and watching me and my friends just talk about random shit um and me bore everybody with gathering the Assassin's Creed, the uh, first Assassin's Creed infinite flags. <laughs> um, so, um, thank you for sticking with me for however long you stuck with me. <laughs> for Howie, that is pretty much the entire stream. For Yvonne, who is in the background of Howie's, uh, um, Discord stuff right now, um, Traitor face, I guess. I don't know. I don't know where I was going with that. Aww. Oh. Also, he called you a traitor face. What? Because you left! Because you left. I'm still here! Supporting you! <laughs> okay, fine. I rescind this traitor face. Um. Good. Um. But, yeah, so, um, I'm actually gonna, I'm gonna call it here, eh, as I continue to vamp for five more minutes, <laughs> to get it at the 4.30 mark. Uh, no, um, as I was saying, thank you for, uh, sticking with me for however long you stayed. Um, for those watching on YouTube, please like and subscribe, which is something I completely forgot to say at the end of last one, because I was so frazzled with all the technical difficulties. <laughs> Did you say it at the end of the last one? I don't know. I didn't actually I did not. the, the video. <clears throat> I did not. It, it, I thought it just sort of cut off. It, it does. Die. It does. It, 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 I, I came back in long enough to basically say, uh, okay, I'm done. Bye. <laughs> um, and, yeah, it was... Well, don't be a gravekeeper if you can't handle bones. Um... Some people have evil bones. Fair, fair. Um, well, this is this has been the first official, uh, second 
introduction to Altair and Assassin's Creed 1. Um, thank you for watching. As I said already, like and subscribe if you're on YouTube. Uh, thank you for watch, uh, watching me on Twitch if you're here on Twitch. And um, I guess I'll see you next week. Wash your hands. Wear masks. Drink water. Uh, all those healthy things. Don't forget that we still got a lot of shit happening in this world. Um, Let's and by the time anybody actually gets around to watching these. <laughs> I want to say rude, but it's so true. Um, so true. Yeah. If, if anybody ever watches them, but it's fine. If you're watching this and I do end up getting famous, hey! Uh, if not, whatever. <laughs> It's a thing that I'm doing that's fun, and I'm enjoying it, and that's what matters. Um, that I'm not... I will enjoy this, and you all will be bored watching me enjoy this. <laughs> continue wrapping it, wrapping it up, bud. I have still have three minutes yet! If I keep, if I keep ramping, you know... No, I'm, I'll go ahead and call it, I'll go ahead and call it there. Um, thanks for watching. Like and subscribe, as I've said the third time now. Um... And I will see you next uh, next week, y'all. Peace. If I can find the button. There's the button.